We're here with AJ Galanti, president of Elite Boxing Enterprises and manager Delvin Rodriguez. AJ coming off a big win last night. How you feeling? Good, feeling good. You know, a long time coming from the June match. We're happy to get back on the winning path and you know, we're very happy with the crowd and you know, Delvin's dominating performance as always. So, you know, we're very happy. Did you expect Delvin to just dominate the way he did last night? Uh, you know, Comanche boy was tough, man. He he took a beating, you know. I mean, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about it, but he kept coming, you know. He didn't quit. You got to give him a lot of credit, you know. But, um, you know, I hate, I don't want to sound cocky or too confident, but, you know, we expect that from Delvin. You know, we expect dominating performances. We expect wins, and, you know, that was the Delvin that, you know, that has to be the Delvin every single fight. You know, we got to get more consistent, and, uh, you know, I, I think... Um, that's what we're going to see from here on out. So, you know, it was definitely a dominating foot. Did I, 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 um, did I expect to go the distance? No. Um, but at the same time, you know, I, 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 I expect dominating. So, you know, he's in shape. He's ready to go. And, you know, we're, we're ready for the, next, for the next one. So moving on from here, what should we be looking for towards, you know, with Elite Boxing and Delvin? Well, you know, right now, you know, we're going to enjoy this win the rest of the weekend, basically. And then... I'm going to sit down with our promoter, Joe DeGuardia, and, uh, you know, Ron Katz. And, uh, you know, we're going to talk about what's next. I mean, it, it's easy. You know, since I've been Delvin's manager and, and, you know, our position's always been the same. We want the best best fighters, top 10 guys. Um, you know, Comanche Boy wasn't a top 10 guy, but we were coming off a loss. He was undefeated. Um, you know, I didn't think it was an easy fight, but I expected to dominate, you know. Um, we'll fight anybody. You know, right now, you know, James Kirkland's kind of resurfaced. Um, you know, he's saying anybody can get it. Well, you know, come and get, come and get it then. And uh, you know, Alfredo, Alfredo Angulo could get it. Um, Carlos Molina. You know, all these guys. Gabe Rosado. I mean, any of them. I mean, we want top ten guys. And, and that's. And I'm not calling anybody out. It's just a fact that the matter is, we respect these guys in the top ten, and that's who we want to fight. So, it's not a matter of whether Delvin Rodriguez or, or, or Starbucks and or I want a top ten guy. It's whether a top ten guy wants us. And we'll, you know, we'll see what happens. So we're, we're gonna see what happens. Um, you know, I, I'm looking forward to it. But like I said, we'll go back. You know, me, Joe DeGuardia, Ron Cat, start boxing. We'll, we'll sit down and talk, and we'll go from there. All right, man. Well, do you have any last things you want to say to all the fans that came and watched from home last night? You no, know, I just want to say thank you to everybody. You know, honestly, you know, everyone who supported us. You know, even after our tough loss and believed in us. You know, we're happy. We're 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 ecstatic with the win. And at the same time, you know. We expect to win, so you know we're happy, and um, you know that's what? it. That's it. So we're we're gonna go from there, and, and that's it. All right, man. Congratulations. Thanks. And best of luck. Thank you. I'm a leaf, feel the heat. Homeboy, you can't compete. You can't see me in the ring. You can't see me in the street.